guys, how about we go thrifting on this beautiful sunny day? So if you haven't been to the Goodwill bins before, it's all these bins that are sometimes full of stuff, sometimes empty, and they bring out new items all day long, and you never know what you're going to find. So you just want to come, dig. These are definitely some older placemats right here. And it's just like a treasure hunt, because every time you come, you just never know what you're going to find. You could come at different times of the day as well, and there'll be all new stuff it looks like we are not off to a great start today but we're definitely going to keep digging and keep looking looks like they got some corn in here look at that i dug through that whole side and did not find anything so now i am looking through this side i did just find a little leg right here it looks porcelain oh here we go it's her leg <laughs> Here's a cute little Easter bunny. I like these muslin Easter bunnies, but I don't like her dress. Also, she's missing legs. It's just the top of a bunny. Here's a snowman. I think he might be handmade. Bin of puzzles, toys, some floral down here. Not really any good floral. Y'all hear that noise? That means they're changing out the bigger bins right now. I'm gonna show y'all. These are the bigger bins and they're full of clothing. All of the clothing is paid by the pound. It is, um, I think, $1.95 per pound. Let me move out of the way. You can't be in the way when they're changing out the bins. I don't want to get yelled at. Here's a rusty nail. That is an interesting shape. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that, but I'm gonna put it in my cart in case I have an idea. A little straw hat. That is really cute, and I think I could add some more florals in here to make it even cuter. I like this rope detail on it. Okay, I think I'm going to get that. That'll be perfect for spring. I love those just to hang on a little hook, um, just as spring decor. And since you can kind of add in some florals, you could change out the florals for the different seasons. Here's a Christmas tree. I like the little red pot that it's in but I don't like the tree oh wow what is this is this a, it's just a bunch of red yarn look how bright this red is it's almost like neon red oh look here's a ton of yarn right here I ended up grabbing some yarn because I'm gonna insert a picture of how little balls of yarn could look really cute as decor. Look at this precious little rocker. I don't see any price on it. It's so cute. Hopefully somebody rescues that. We have this huge storage piece right here. $16.99. It's old and, ch oh wow. Okay, I was not expecting that on the inside. <gasps> Oh my gosh, y'all. Hey! <laughs> I wish I had a place to put this. <gasps> this is so cute. $16.99. Oh, look, there's the feet. It has feet with it. Somebody come rescue this piece. Somebody come rescue this. Oh, I bet this pulls out. It does. So you can easily access your... Oh, I gotta close this. You can easily access your clothes. Ooh, this looks like a hand carved piece right here. I have no clue. Is it missing some pieces or it just hangs on the wall like this? I am not sure. Oh wait, there's a tag on it. Let's see, letter holder, $24. It's all broken up. I'm not gonna get this piece. There's a huge snowman, but he is missing his nose. Probably about four feet tall. Something like this would probably be about two dollars over here. There's a percolator, but I don't know, it has that weird dude on it, so I'm not gonna get that. Ooh, some little heart little molds. I'm definitely gonna get that. Here's a wreath right here. Pretty dusty. They got some Christmas decor. This looks like a little baby toy. Ball. Here's a huge tray. Oh, it's plastic. 
I thought maybe it was wood. It's in this box. Looks like some clear mason jars. All right, I just found this rolled up carpet remnant. It looks brand new. I can't unroll it to really look at it, but it looks like it is in really good condition. So I'm gonna bring this home because I think we could either use this at our house or at a camp. I'll definitely put on the screen what I paid for this whole piece right here. And I just got this because I can always use these little bins and stuff in the shipping room. Man, somebody got their cart covered, but look at that table under there. It looks like a little side table. I wish I could look at the whole thing, but I don't want to pull off the blanket in somebody else's cart. Lots of clothing here today as usual. What is this metal piece over here? Oh, it's a little vanity chair. That's cute. Oh, what is this? Is this a leather briefcase or is this maybe a medical bag because it looks pretty big but it does have a cool look to it i don't know should i get this piece okay i just google lens this and apparently this is a french doctor's bag so it is 100 percent gone in a cart how did i end up with a cart full all of a sudden i found some wooden finial tops i always pick these up i use them for a ton of different um diys i also got rent some crocs she will love that. She doesn't have any pink ones. I think I'm going to head out. They've been rolling out new bins, but it's been clothing, and I just did not find a lot today. Even though I got a cart full, <laughs> it's mostly bigger items. So y'all leave me a comment below. Let me know what's your favorite item. Let me know if this was a good find, even though it's in pretty rough condition. But I don't know. I feel like that adds to the character and the charm of it. So I hope y'all enjoy today's thrifting adventure. You always got to come. You never know what you're going to find. Some days are hit. Some days are missed. I will put a total on the screen of what I spent on this entire cart. And I will see y'all in my next thrifting adventure.